During the course of a starter motor's life, it must successfully complete thousands of start cycles. We need to know how these systems operate, because eventually they'll fail. Hi, I'm Clint. Welcome to Automate. A starter motor is an electrical device used to start an internal combustion engine. The starter motor is one part of a system consisting of the DC motor, starter solenoid, battery and control system. The starter motor provides the initial turning effort to rotate the crankshaft for ignition of the air-fuel mixture. In cold conditions, the starter motor must overcome a very high resistive force, courtesy of the lubricating oil's high viscosity and friction from the engine components. The heaviest load on the starter motor is when it first encounters this resistance and draws high levels of current from the vehicle starting battery to produce the breakaway torque required. On a four-cylinder gasoline engine, this may be around 400 amps, but on a larger, high-compression diesel engine, this could be upwards of 800 amps. When the starter is operated, current from the battery flows to a solenoid, where it crosses a set of contacts, then enters the electric motor's brush set. The current exits the brush at the commutator segment, where it flows through a set of windings, creating a strong magnetic field. This magnetic field reacts to an opposite field from the pole shoes or permanent magnets, causing the shaft to rotate. To watch the full video or any of our other automotive training modules, just visit our website and find out how you can become an Automate member today.